That's just what I needed. So for today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys my the end of the 12 Pans of Christmas project that I started. Um, I started it in November. I don't know what day, but it ended on December 25th, which is Christmas. Yeah, let's just go ahead and get right into the video. So here I have my notebook for the prompt Christmas tree. Um, I was trying to hit pan on my NARS um, this is the exposed palette and I was working on this one right here I think it's called give it away or it could be called new fling I'm not too too sure but my goal was to hit pan and clearly I did not meet that goal this one right here um, but I did use this 26 times in the past two months so yeah for my next item it was the stockings prompt and i believe it was like something small um but i pulled my ulta primer for that and this is the hydrating face primer my goal is to finish it and i definitely like underestimated it so it's not finished at all um but i did use this 22 times in the past two months the next prompt is presents and i believe it was like something you wanted for a while um i pulled my bff palette from um, bh cosmetics and i was working on the shade ootd which is this dark rich brown color my goal was to use it 25 times and i only used it 16 times so i needed to use it nine more times but i did not meet my goal but overall, I'm happy that I used it the amount of times that I did. I I was working pretty hard, but I guess not too, too hard. <laughs> My next one is Father Christmas, and I'm not too sure what that is like about. I will put the, you know, the prompts on the screen because I totally forgot. But for Father Christmas, I pulled this lip oil from Lottie London. It's called Oil Slick and it's in the shade Extra Cherries. I gave myself the goal to finish this and that was a pretty like crazy, ew, it looks, sorry, that was a pretty crazy Oh, it looks like there was like it looks like there's something in there but I guess not um yeah that was a pretty crazy goal I really do not like this um it just feels like it feels like drying and it just does not feel pleasant on my lips so I only use this nine times so when I put it into the project it was right there where the black line is and that's where it's at today um, I'm not too sure if I'm going to toss this or keep it, but we'll see. Next prompt is Christmas lights, and I believe it was like something sparkly. So for that, I pulled this setting mist. It is called, okay, so it's completely rubbed off now, but it's it's from the Beauty Crop, and it's the Cocoa Gold Mist Hydrating Setting Mist. Like it's all, the lettering is all gone, but... For this, my goal was to finish and I clearly did not meet that goal, but I did a really good job at it. So when I first put it into this project, we were up to that line, that little tiny line right there. And now we're all the way down to here, which is pretty good like for me. So I used this 33 times in the past two months and that's pretty good, like I'll take it. I didn't finish it, but I did I did I did that basically next I have this drunk elephant broad spectrum sunscreen it has SPF 30 so my goal this is a reindeer prompt so my goal was to finish this and again I really underestimated it just because they're small like really doesn't mean anything like there's a ton of product in here so I did not obviously meet that goal, but I did use it 19 times in the past two months. So 
yeah i really like this packaging like i like how you just twist it like you twist it and then it comes out and then you lock it um but i don't really love the product itself like it's kind of like chunky i don't know if mine's old and you just kind of have to keep rubbing it i don't know it's it's like it's like eh. moving on to the snowflakes prompt i'm not too sure what you know the meaning behind that is but again i'll leave you know everything on the screen um i pulled this mark jacobs bronzer and my usage goal was 32 i almost almost met that goal so in the month of december i was like if i use it every day for these next few days i will meet the goal but what happened was i had like it was just a lot like obviously it's getting closer and closer to christmas time so it was just a lot for me so here's what the bronzer looks like i actually used this 26 times and i just needed six more uses and i would hit my 32 um usage goal but anyways i'm actually very proud that i used it that many times and i was like neglecting my other bronzer in my project pan but it didn't pay off so i don't know it is what it is <laughs> all right my next makeup item was this tarte mascara and this was for the prompt gingerbread house and that was something decorative and i just thought that this was really like decorative um there's a hair on me my goal was to finish this um i don't know like where i was at when i put this into the project like i don't know if i used it a lot prior or if i didn't use it much so i didn't know what i was getting myself into but i kind of knew that it, there was a lot of product in here which doesn't really matter um my goal is to finish it i did not finish it and towards the end of this project i wasn't using this at all like for i want to say a week straight i didn't use mascara because i wanted my lashes to be extra extra clean because i knew i was getting lash extensions so yeah i used this 22 times in the past two months and i mean that's pretty good for me but it, i didn't finish it moving on to mistletoe that's a product you love and for that, I pulled my Laneige Lip Sleeping Mask. I believe this is in the berry um, flavor. So my goal was to like hit pan. And in my intro video, I like put quotations over that because I didn't know, um, like, I didn't know if I hit pan, like it was gonna finish essentially. But all in all, I hit my goal on this. So. I did actually hit the bottom of the tube, which you can see. I love this product so much. Um, it really helped putting it into this project because I have like so many lip products that I would use like in the morning or and then before going to bed. So I wasn't necessarily focusing on just this, but I've had this for two years now. So, so putting it into this project like really helped me out. Um, with using it and things like that so i used this a total of 51 times in the past two months which i am super happy about and just it's just so satisfying to see and it made me really happy so i hit one goal so far um and yeah i'm gonna talk about like a project pan for the new year at the end of this video so i kind of want to put this into a project pan so i can finish it all up but i'll get um into that at the end um my next one is snowman i'm not too sure what the meaning behind that is again but i'll put it on the screen um for snowman prompt i pulled this milk makeup um it's like a what is this it is a holographic stick there we go um for this i wanted to finish it again i underestimated a small product um but when i put it into the project it was down to here and we are right here i didn't make another mark but this product is okay like it's not like it's not easy to blend obviously it's like in a 
cream formula so i prefer like liquid things over this but i tried my hardest to use it as much as possible and i used this 19 times which it's it's okay you know not too crazy um moving on for the sleigh prompt i pulled my mac velvet teddy um and my goal was to finish this so i know that some of these goals were like crazy and wouldn't be met but i like to set like higher goals for myself that way i work really hard towards achieving that goal even though i know that they're not going to be achievable if that makes any sense you know okay anyways i use this lipstick 19 times and it's looking pretty pretty bad because my son got a hold of it but that is a lot of product around you know the tube but that's kind of what we're at right now i'm probably just gonna have to toss i don't know my final makeup item was candy cane and this was a duo product for that i pulled this natasha denona left cheek duo and my usage goal was 20 20 for each um you know to use to use each one 20 times for so for the blush, I used it 16 times. I only needed four more uses. Look how good she is looking. And then for the highlighter, I used it 17 times and I only needed three more uses. <sighs> I don't know. I really don't know. With this highlighter, I was not loving it at all. It's a pink highlighter. It's not something that I ever really go towards and yeah i just was not loving the highlighter i was forcing myself to use it and the blush i really really loved it as you can tell i loved it a lot i'm very happy about this because if i didn't put it in this project i'm pretty sure it wouldn't have been used like i don't know this is not something that i really reach for um so i'm really happy that i put her in the project but another goal not met so that completes this project, the 12 Pants of Christmas project. Um, I want to say like this project was really fun for me. Um, towards the end, I was getting a little bit like bored with like a few of the products, like the highlight, the lipstick, um, like these two little things I wasn't like loving. But all in all, it was really fun and I enjoyed like pushing myself. I'm like, I gotta do my makeup today. I gotta do my makeup today. I gotta do my makeup today. And like some of the days I literally just sat um, in my house with like a full face of makeup on and like, that's okay. At least like I was trying, you know what I mean? I'm happy that it's over. So yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and end this video right here. I just wanted to give you guys a little sneak peek as to what I'm gonna be doing in the new year. I'm gonna be doing 23 pans in 2023 or for 2023. But yeah, you guys will hear that in my next video, which is gonna be my project pan updates video. Um, but yeah, I just wanted to give you guys a little hinty hint. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna end this video right here. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. I know your girl didn't meet too many goals i think i literally just met one but it is what it is um thank you guys so much for watching please be sure to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe down below if you aren't already to join my pink and girly fam and i will see you beauties in my next video bye